Hey everybody, it's Eva Mikajono. Welcome back to more Pokemon Fire Red. In the last part, we beat Koga of the Fusion City Gym, and then we arrived in Saffron City, where we are now looking to take on Team Rocket and Silph Co. Yes, you probably noticed that I'll cut out most of the battles in this place, because there are just too many of them. It'll take me almost three parts if I go through all of them, so that's not going to happen. Okay, I don't think there's anything in this room. Okay, now if you go on that, you have to fight this guy, so uh, we may as well show this fight. Alright, first battle of the day that I'm showing anyway. Scientist Parker is sending out a Grimer. And I'm going to send out Pidgeotto on level 32. 32. Alright. Oh crap, I'm going to poison again. Ready, poison? Oh! <laughs> okay. That's something different. How embarrassing. Alright, come on. Alright, he's using Electro. We'll throw out Venusaur. Once again, one of those battles where absolutely nothing special happens. So there really is nothing to talk about. Um, if anyone wants to leave comments on any of my videos or something for me to talk about when there is something to talk about, please feel free for me to talk about something or discuss something if you wish for me to discuss something because any part of this, seriously, what happens? I mean, there's nothing to talk about. So, leave a comment, rate through, whatever. Leave a comment if you would like something to be discussed by me and see how I feel about something, then go for your life. I won't leave it as a biased opinion either, so... Alright, All right, we'll continue our way through Silph Co. Alright, so you can't go through those doors yet, so we have to say here. I wonder if Silph... That's great encouragement and belief in your company. I wonder if it's finished. <laughs> Alright. Right, back where we started. Alright. Alright, come on. Alright, fifth floor. Let's go around here. Oh! <laughs> Alright. Now. Here's where something half decent happens, I guess. Now, you have to come to the fifth floor to obtain the item I'm about to obtain. Alright, there's level 33 Arbok. Against my level 32. This could be a problem. This really could be a problem. Alright, come on, let's see how it goes, anyway. Hey, Lucky that missed! Man, what is it with these R-Box lucky to use glare on me? I mean, gee. Am I really- Oh, you! Oh. Alright. Like, as I was saying about before, because there's nothing again happening in the battle. Oh, alright, okay, well, there you go. That's how it feels to be paralyzed, Darbo. Alright, um, yeah, about that thing I've discussed. Alright, uh, if you leave a discuss comment on the thing, I will say, obviously, who, what your username is. Um, say, for example, your username is Bob Tim or whatever it is. I'll say, who. Why do they use Thunderway for? I don't know. Um, anyway, yeah, I'll say, say for example, your username is Bob Tim or whatever. I don't know what the hell your username is. Um, you leave a comment, I will refer to your username first and refer to the question that you asked and I will help discuss it. Make sure it's a relevant question, no, I'm not going to answer any question that can easily be found over Google or whatever. But uh, yeah, I'll do my best to help you out. Alright, let's just heal these guys up. Alright, come on. Okay, and that's what you have to do if you want to get past that area there. And come down here and you need a card key. Card key opens up those doors I was talking about before. Yay! Let's do some ice skating. Woo! Woohoo! Alright, let's get out of here. Alright, I don't think there's anything on this floor. Except here we go. Um, we will. There you go, that's what it does. 
open. It's like, all you do is press A on the door and it says bingo, the card can open the door, whatever. Alright, back on the 10th floor. Alright, now as you can see, there are plenty of items here. We find a Carbos. A rare candy. And last but not least, a Ultra Ball. Alright, come on, let's get out of here. This is the gayest part about it. Now I've got to try and find the area where we got to go to next. Um, don't think it's down there. Uh, stairs. Okay, you want to battle me? Alright, uh, we'll see what's in here. Okay, so it's a few people running around. Alright, uh, let's go back downstairs. Alright, we'll try in here. Come on, hey, come on. There we go. Alright. Ooh, that was close. Alright, um, alright. Let's see what this goes here. And we're back on the fourth floor, how fun. Alright, let's go back. And bingo, the card came for another door. Woo! And we're back on the fourth floor. Alright. Kind of trying our best get around this guy. Woo! Oh, you! Alright, I'll just run down that teleporter here. It takes you here. Um, alright. Go back up there. This is, that's where we have to go, in that room there. So we don't really need to go up this part of the 11th floor. Take the elevator to go back down. Sorry it's taking so long. I just kind of forgot my way through. I think I know where I'm going now. I'm almost 100% I'm sure it's down here. Alright, well why did I just stay on the 5th floor? I should have just stayed on the... I'm pretty sure it's the 5th floor we have to go to. Alright, going here you find a protein. Alright, I'm pretty sure you go in this door. I should have gone here in the first place. I don't know why. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's this place you have to go to. And we find Focus Punch. Um, Focus Punch is a good move if you can get it to work. But other than that, oh, I don't recommend Because if you get hit, then you lose focus and the move doesn't happen. Alright, now this is where you go. I'm pretty sure this is where you go. I'm pretty sure this is where you go. Yes, it is where you go. All right, after healing up, we see that our rival is here. What kept you, Jono? Anyway. Why didn't you help me, you jerk? Oh, you're asking for it now. That's it. All right, you'll see that he's Pidgeotto. He's evolved into Pidgeot. It's a level 37. So, uh, off, see, off video there, I got my Pidgeotto around with my Raichu because he really shouldn't have any problems with Pidgeotto, so... Ooh! Jeez! Oh! No way! Come on! Thank you. And Raichu goes to level 33. <laughs> oh, sorry about that. It's been kind of, it's been kind of weird lately. All right. Thunderbolt. I don't know why he sent Karras out there. He has a quad weakness to my right to Thunderbolt, and he sends that out there. That is the most ridiculous strategy I've ever seen. Ah, oh, he says it's got an execute. He's still got this execute. Alright, intimidate you, even though I don't think you know any physical moves anyway, but oh well. Oh, you jerk! Oh! Um, remember how in Lavender Tower, I don't know if you remember, but I remember when we were in Lavender Tower, I said that I had to take quite a few takes to beat the rival? Yeah, that would have been because of his execute. I might show those one day, who knows, I might bring those up one day on YouTube. Um, anyway, I can go to level 33. And he's going to use Alakazam. I have the weirdest feeling that I'm going to go overtime here. I hope I don't, I hope I get this battle out of the way. It would be really good if we get this battle out of the way. 
Oh, come on, Arcanine! What? What an idiot! Okay. <laughs> so you do it again? Oh. Oh, you crack me up, Toru. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Alright, no. Come on, somebody. Thank you. Alright, come on, let's just finish it off. Ooh, use it again. That's all he's used, he hasn't used anything else. Oh, alright, that ends his Alakazam. Now here comes the big prize, Charizard. Alright, come on. Yeah, we're definitely going to run out of time here. There's no way we're going to finish this battle off. Come on, Raichu, survive. Come on. No. Alright, next time in Pokemon Fire Red, we're going to finish this battle with Toru. Goodbye.